Greetings everyone and uh, thank you for tuning in to this video. This is uh, Sean. I'm going to uh, present to you um, a very uh, particular brand out of uh, the UK. It's uh, Edwin Jagger. As you can see here, I've got the uh, Edwin Jagger DE89 and I've loaded a uh, Persona blade. I've never uh, tried these before in a razor and I'm very excited to uh, try these out. Uh, yeah, here are these particular uh, blades. The Persona, they're uh, middle of the road strength. So not too uh, aggressive, yet not too mild. And um, these, uh, this particular brand here, Edwin Drager, is uh, based out of uh, Sheffield, England. Um, I've uh, read it's a very um, industrial uh, steel producing uh, city. And as you can see here, the Edwin Jagger, very uh, elegant in design, and just it's perfect for the uh, novice uh, wet shaver. And um, the uh, shaving cream and uh, aftershave that I'll be using for today's shave will be uh, this, these, uh, the Edwin Jagger sandalwood shaving cream and aftershave. And these are made with 99% uh, uh, natural ingredients, uh, paraben free. And uh, for the pre shave, be the Edward Jager pre shave lotion. And uh, just to save time, I've already g gone ahead and uh, made the uh, lather. And I'm using my uh, Parker uh, silver tip. Badger uh, shaving brush. So, um, without further ado, let's get started. Just had to wet my cheeks with warm water. Let's go ahead and apply a little, this, little bit of this uh, pre-shave lotion. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this smells like a uh, eucalyptus. I think there are also a bit of traces of uh, menthol in this lotion. There we are. And I'll just go ahead and uh, apply the cream. So how is everybody doing today? It's Easter. Happy Easter. Yeah, so as you know, we're in the midst of the uh, great COVID-19 pandemic. So um, I uh, hope you all are uh, taking the necessary precautions Staying home, only going out to uh, go to work and pick up groceries and uh, attend essential appointments. So, yeah. 
Well, as remember, remember to wash your hands often. And I will uh, definitely uh, recommend that um, before each shave. Yeah, it's kind of a uh, soft sandalwood uh, scent to this. Okay, so we'll go ahead, first pass with the grain. Definitely doing its job. Yeah, it definitely uh, picks up the uh, hairs. I uh, have uh, four days worth of uh, facial growth. Now this is actually the uh, first time I've uh, featured my Edwin Jaeger DE89 in a shaving video. I made a uh, video about this uh, uh, quite a while ago, but um, that was just in regards to the uh, razor itself. I feel like you can check out that video. Yeah, so from what I've heard, yeah, uh, I think I'm starting to believe it already. These Edwin Jager shaving creams are very slick. Yeah. It's only the first pass, but... Uh, Already, my uh, cheeks are starting to feel quite smooth. Seems as if this cream is of in of a high quality. Now, normally I would just uh, fill up my sink full of water, but uh, because of this pandemic, I'm just uh, rinsing it off my razor off with a uh, fresh water by uh, opening uh, the uh, tap every single time I need to rinse it. Just to minimize the uh, risk of uh, catching infection. Yeah, for sure, sure, still be able to order these online. Razors, creams, pre-shave lotions, after shaves, etc. Going to Amazon.
Yeah. I'd have to say this cream is working well. Now I have to say this uh, razor here, it's pretty mild. I like, I like uh, more aggressive razors. Like uh, <laughs> the Mula R41, now that's a real bad boy. But uh, for the purposes of this video, I'll just uh, Stick to promoting uh, Edwin Jaeger. There, there we go. Yeah, I think um, this cream provides excellent cushioning. Yeah, pretty slick. And I'll go ahead and uh, proceed to the uh, second pass. Rowl shave cross grain. There we are. Okay, get to lather up here again. I think I'll say this about the uh, cream. Uh, it performs well, however, uh, it does lack that uh, strong scent. I really enjoy those uh, strong scents. Yeah, this sandalwood. Yeah, it seems as if you could barely smell it. I shaved, I've also used um, Prorasa Red. Parasso sandalwood uh, shaving cream and aftershave and I think that's uh, The scent of that is a little bit richer than this Um, yeah, this still performs great nonetheless.
have to admit, uh, this is actually my first time I've uh, used this uh, shaving cream as well. Yeah, I think uh, the quantity of it uh, is not as uh, high than you would find in a, a tub of Taylor Vold Bond Street or True Fitton Hill. I mean, this is how much you get. Yeah, it's not too much, but uh, then again, you don't need uh, a whole lot of it to uh, whip up a good lather. So, Edwin Jaeger came into business in 1989, and uh, that's when these uh, razors were uh, introduced, hence the name Edwin Jaeger DE89. It's a double-edged safety razor, and it introduced back in 89. And there we go. Second pass out of the way, on to the third. Yeah, I'll just uh, do three passes for today's shave. Not to be too uh, time consuming, because I know you, you all have uh, busy schedules. And to get the maximum benefit, if you're using a silver tip uh, shaving brush, so soak it in warm water for a minimum of five minutes, just so uh, you get the uh, most softness, that the uh, cream glides on your face just a bit easier. all of this out just so it doesn't go to waste
Okay. Here we are. Go ahead with pass number three against the green. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I can honestly see this uh, cream is providing excellent protection while I shave against the grain. That's probably when I feel uh, the razor blade the most. And uh, that's when I experience uh, irritation the most. Two by going against the grain. It's an even bigger issue when you uh, have to shave every single day. Now my job in particular doesn't compel me to uh, shave every single day, however, it certainly helps. It's not like a, if I'm in the military, then it's a different story. And uh, if any of you uh, who are watching who are uh, members of the armed forces, you would understand. Yeah. There's a certain uh, grace and elegance to traditional wet shaving. If you respect the uh, razor, it'll do wonders for you.
Yeah. I think, um... That looks quite professional enough. Now I'll just rinse my face and uh, apply the uh, aftershave. There we are. Just pat, yeah, just pat dry the base. It's important to just pat dry. That way you don't uh, irritate your skin. Oh yeah, quite smooth. Yes. Okay, now I'll just uh, apply the aftershave. Oh! <laughs> there we go. Stay. <laughs> okay, just a little shot of this. There we go. That's, I'd say that's enough. Yeah, just a little uh, technique I picked up just to allow the uh, aftershave to go through the uh, pores of my skin. Yeah, there we are. Okay. Yeah. All right. So um, overall, it's a very uh, high uh, quality uh, shaving cream. Uh, I don't think um, this scent is as strong as I would like it to be. I hear that uh, the sandalwood scent from uh, Taylor Volt Bond Street is uh, much stronger. So maybe the next time I uh, purchase a uh, tub of shaving cream, I'll invest in that. But um, yeah, I think even with uh, the uh, aftershave right here, the scent is very light. I don't know if it uh, has an issue with the, um, if it's an issue of uh, all natural ingredients that are combined or um, lack of chemical properties. But uh, for me, I just find that is the case since it's all, it's all natural that it would lack uh, the properties of uh, a rich scent. But that's just my take. Okay, so... Just uh, to summarize, I did a, a three-pass uh, shave with this, the uh, Edwin Jaeger DE89 uh, razor, equipped with a fresh Persona blade. Yeah, I'd have to say um, these worked uh, well against my face. There's no uh, irritation, as you can see. 
feel my face feels pretty smooth. Smooth as it should be. Uh, for the pre-shave lotion, uh, it's from Edwin Jager. And uh, for the aftershave, the uh, Edwin Jager sandalwood. And uh, to produce all that lather, I used the uh, silver tip badger shaving brush from Parker and a regular coffee mug. So that's it. So I hope you found this video to be helpful. Um, please stay safe wherever you are. Um, if you don't have to go out at all, stay at home and uh, learn uh, new, that way you can learn new uh, shaving techniques and learn more about uh, shaving products. And uh, yep, I wish you well. So this is a, uh, this has been Sean. Uh, I thank you for watching this video and I wish you uh, peace, much love and namaste. Take care, have a great day.